Lucas Media. So C Murder and Monica have split up. Now I didn't even know they were back together, but you know whatever. So C Murder came out and said that, or Monica came out and said that she moved on. I guess she posted pictures with her and somebody else, and she basically said she's been hurt multiple times, but now she's moved on. So C Murder came out and said that um quote i don't know why somebody feels the need to publicly bash a person fighting for their life and he continued to say i'm a black man fighting and hoping for the freedom one day want to speak on something let's talk about freeing us louisiana inmates held illegally and unconstitutionally by racist jim crow laws uh and i'll, I'll drop the link to the article you know, here's my two cents. So apparently, like I said, they were dating and allegedly he had other people and all that good stuff. Well, I feel see murder. I don't feel like people should be locked up. Well, people are saying that he didn't do it. And I know he's been locked up pretty much for over 20 years. I don't know. When you live a certain kind of lifestyle that see murder was living, unfortunately, you know, yes, Louisiana has messed up laws, but bro, you know, and I was a huge fan of C Murder, I had his albums and everything, but it's kind of like, you know, when you put yourself in those situations, even though it was 20 years ago, he's unfortunately paying for these laws. Now, witnesses first came out and said he was, he killed the, the, the young man, and then some people said that he didn't do it. I don't know. According to the documentary, he didn't do it. But just being in that position cost him the rest of his life. You know, and even with him and Monica, I don't really think I wouldn't be surprised that they didn't stay together. See, murder doing life. Most people are, you know, they gonna move on when people are locked up. And for everybody that's listening, man, remember that when you doing time, 15 years like Casanova. Life like C murder. Remember they gave Max B 75 years, but I, I'm assuming he getting out sometime. The people that you're dealing with at some point they move on, they have kids, they stop writing, they stop putting money on your books, and it's just not worth it. C murder was a multi-millionaire. I remember he had that big house on BT How I'm Living. Platinum artist. And I remember he had that documentary with, I think, Ice-T. And you still got apartment in the hood. You're still shooting dice. You're still, you know, doing whatever. And unfortunately, whether even though you, you, you may be innocent, cost you the rest of your life, at least for now. But, I mean, none of this surprises me. Like I said, people be locked up all the time. They partners be cheating and leaving or whatever. I remember a girl, she was locked up, or her uh, guy was locked up for like seven years, and she was out here wilding. Another person, he was locked up in the feds, and, and his wife got pregnant with somebody else. So yeah, man, forget all that, man. The, the, the street life is dead. It's been dead since Frank Lucas, Nikki Barnes, and even before them, even with Al Capone. But I just want to give my quick two cents on it. And tell me what y'all think about it.